Vicki, when you were in therapy, trying to integrate all of your many personalities, why didn't you tell the small-minded, suspicious one to go take a hike? Actually, I think it's a sign of my mental health that I don't believe a word you say. Mm. I'm sure you didn't mean to interrupt, so excuse us. Kelly, I don't know what Joe told you he was doing today, but he's obviously not at the country club. So, why don't you come home with me and we'll continue our discussion there. Thank uh, you. Look, look I, I have my own car. But I want to tell you, I still believe in such a thing called first and true love. The kind that lasts. And I have found that with Joey. Why do you make it sound as if that isn't what I want for you? I just don't want you to get hurt, all right? But fine, if it's a risk you have to take in order to be happy. Come on, let's talk about this in my place. Just one moment, please. Excuse me. Pardon me. Uh, just one moment. I don't mean to interrupt, but I have to say this, Vicky. Despite your abiding distrust of me, what I really want for my family and for your family is for this feud between us to be over. And that is why, Cord, I hope that everything works out perfectly for you. That you can work out something with my tenant and that the, the deal goes through the sale without a hitch and, you know, that, that everybody lives happily ever after. Yeah, well, if this were a fairy tale, Dorian, I guess your tenant wouldn't be so late. Oh, you have a meeting right now. Mm -hmm. Oh, well, I think you should give them a few more minutes because... You know, at this hour, God knows what the traffic is like. Let me know how it turns out, will you? And Vicky, have a very nice evening. Come, Sally. At least let me walk. Now you tell me. Is that woman up to something? I feel exactly the same way you do. Every time Dorian is that nice to me, I always check to make sure my wallet is exactly where I left it. Excuse me. Oh. Oops. Okay, I have got to make a phone call. Uh, and, and, and I'm going to have to go home. I'm sorry, Court. I can't wait. I, I told you I have dinner guests. Marty and Dylan are coming. Oh, please give right? them my best. And don't worry about this. I can handle this. We're going to be fine. And I will let you know what happened with this mystery tenant. Yes, please do. I'm very, very curious. All right. You can call me as late as you want. Okay. Will do. Thank you. Good night. Oh, Philip. Uh, excuse me. Um, has anyone asked for me? I, I'm supposed to meet a client here that I've never actually met face to face. Uh, he said he was going to be here. I don't know whether I'm early or he's late. No one's left a message, Mr. Roberts. But, but if I see anybody... Right, I just sent them over here to my table. Thanks. Appreciate it. Oh, boy. Excuse me. You wouldn't happen to be Cord Roberts, would you? 